acceptance. You have no idea. It's like you live in a country where you work, you work hard, uh, you try to be normal, you try to be decent, and you pay your taxes like everybody else. And then all of a sudden, it's like this is going to sound really strange. You never felt like you were part of this country. This referendum came around, and all of a sudden, it's like, oh my God, actually, you are. You're part of Ireland. Amazing. Being a double minority, it really made me feel at home, especially being in Ireland, that I'm accepted for who I am, being black and gay, and that I can be afforded the same rights as everyone else. I think the best thing to come to the American Threshold referendum for all of us was that, you know, it forced people to make a kind of a general topic of discussion, you know, and there was people, you know, I suppose, telling their children about it, and yeah, I suppose overall it was kind of a, a general feeling of kind of inclusion for, for the gay people, like, you know, and myself included. It meant a lot, but I guess it was also just the whole referendum, having to vote for the right to marry um, someone you love is kind of degrading and a breach of human rights in a way as well. For me, well, I, I came out in 1995, and 1995 in Ireland was a lot different from 2015. So it's like, it was 20 years later, but at the time I can remember my parents weren't that accepting. My friends, I, I never told any of them. And 20 years down the line, it's like a whole different world. And I'm so happy for the guys that are younger who can do that, that it's, that's the yeah. life they've got. I didn't have that life when I was 20, but now that I'm 40, I have that life. Yeah. It was, I suppose, a culmination, because myself and my partner are 20 years together this week and we just couldn't believe what happened in this country. So it's a combination of huge pride in the Irish people for getting past, you know, a traditionalism that needs to be passed and for getting out there and voting. It was just amazing. Well, coming from London where gay is very accepted, um, when I came to Ireland I didn't realise that it wasn't uh, accepted at the time. So when I actually came to it, it was it was a good sense of like I was I felt home and I felt safe and I felt embraced. So that's what I meant to me.